Welcome to MB Trading's online tutorial series. This presentation covers features related to stock trading with MB Trading. Before we get started, please take a few minutes to read through our legal disclosures on this slide. This presentation covers order entry using the MB Trading Desktop Pro platform for trading stocks. The following video will teach you how to use the depth ladder or depth of market view trading window with the MB Trading Desktop Pro platform for trading stocks. You will first click on File, New, Depth of Market. Initially, the window will be detached from your workspace, meaning that you can move it off to another monitor. To lock it onto the workspace, you will press the button with the red arrow pointing into the window on the top part of the window. That will lock in your depth ladder. You then can change the size by stretching it out or by maximizing the window to give you a view of the market. To populate an equity, you will type in the symbol and click enter. This will initiate your depth ladder and provide you with the current bid size and the ask size as well as the volume indicator. To place a market order using the depth ladder, you will simply choose under type market order and then click on either buy or short. So if we were to buy, once we have bought, you will see your position, 100 shares, your profit and loss, and the price moving up and down the depth ladder. If you click on the red X, it will sell out of the position at a market order. You can also sell out the traditional way by choosing a market order and clicking on sell. If you wanted to short at market, you would simply click on short and it would short at market. You can also set up different sell limit and sell stop orders by moving up and down the ladder. For example, if we were to choose a limit order, we could set up a buy for 100 shares below where the current market is trading by clicking on the depth ladder at the position we're looking to get in. So for example, if we wanted to get in here at $20, we would simply click on buy with a 100 share limit. It will give you a confirmation window. Click on yes. And you can see now in the depth ladder that we have an order to fill 100 shares at $20 a share on Cisco if the price were to go to that level. You will also see this matched in your open orders window. To cancel out of the order, we just click on the red X, or you can use the traditional cancel option. If you wanted to enter with a stop, you would simply choose the stop order. And let's say you wanted to buy, do a buy stop as an entry point. You would choose the entry point on the depth of market ladder. Once you set your order entry, you will see it designated with a STP, 100 shares, and a red X if you wanted to cancel out of that order. Now, if you are already in a trade, you can set up your e exit strategy under the sell order dropdown. So for example, if we wanted to set a sell stop at 20 a share, we would click on the red area in the ladder, click on sell stop, and we now can set up our stop loss for 100 shares. You can cancel that by right clicking and canceling it out. We can set up our take profit right over here under the sell order as well. So if we wanted to set a sell order at 2024, 
we would click on the red area under the ask size and you can see we have our take profit limit now set up. We can choose a TTO order by setting up our take profit and our stop loss and then clicking submit. Once you have clicked on those, you can scroll up and down the ladder to see exactly where those are. So here we can see our upper trigger. And if we were to scroll down, you can see your lower trigger. Now, if you want to get back to where the current market is trading, all you need to do is click on center last. And that will take you back to the current market value and where the stock is actually trading. Now, if you want to set up different preferences for the death ladder, you can right click, select on preferences, and you can set up your preferences for order entry. Preferences for the depth ladder are available on it. And right here, you can set up display options for your colors, for your tiers. You can set up different colors for your ass background, your order entry, and various other options. You can change your font sizes. You can also change your zoom increment by ticks and your market level display depth. Anytime you've made a trade, you simply click on finish and that trade will be handled. As well, the depth ladder offers some basic information, including the bid, ask, the last, the change, the volume, and other pertinent information for the stock that you are trading. If you have any further questions about using the depth ladder or anything else about the Desktop Pro, please feel free to contact our equity support. You can reach that on our website at mbtrading.com and we are available by phone, chat, or email.